Okay guys, welcome to Fiverr Love Diary. It's Trish. I'm back from Maryland Sheep and Wool. It was amazing. I was tired though. And when I got back, I couldn't find the little thing that screws into the camera to put it on the tripod because John took it off of there for me so I could pack my camera and I couldn't find it. So I found it today. And you're probably saying to yourself like, Trish, just hold it in your hand like other people do. I'm clumsy with two hands. What would I be with one hand? I can barely get these boxes open with two hands and a knife. So that's not gonna work. Anyway, we're here to open the May Paradise Fibers box. Um, I also, uh oh. Well, this does not bode well. I don't know if you can see this, but it got wet at some point. Um, I also did buy some stuff at Maryland, but I didn't go crazy. Shocker, I know. And I took a tiny bit of footage. So I'm gonna go ahead and do a, a video showing you guys that footage plus what we, what I purchased and traded with my co-visitor. So are you ready? Look at how easy I did this one. Mayflowers. God, guys, it's actual real spring. In England, snapdragons are blooming. I guess it would be nice to live in England. We barely have daffodils here in Michigan. Ooh, look at this. Oh my gosh, guys. Okay. I'm sorry. Some people love this noise and some people hate it. Sorry about that. It smells good. Ooh. I don't know what it is. Oh wait, here's my sheep. Oh guys, look how cute. I don't know what, I'm so, I want bees and I'm so in love with bumblebees right now. That's cute. Okay. Oh, and there's a rubber band on here too. Don't you know the clumsy people are opening these? Like me? All right, ready? This is Petals Fiber Club Exclusive Blend. And now I did get an email that if you want this box, you've gotta hurry up and get it. It's 100% 23 micron merino wool top. Look. Hi. Oh, I hear angels singing. It's really bright. I don't know what I would even do with it. I think right now my thought is always like to do something bright where I can do it in like fingering weight and then do color work with it. Just like white or black or gray and kind of like make it really a lot of contrast. So right now that's what I have in mind and I would definitely spin this from the fold. I'm actually spinning Caliente from the April spinning box right now from the fold and it's turning out so gorgeous. It's insane. Okay, and this is... It says stem on the little label. Where do they find these cute bags? Rose Cellulose Mulberry Silk 50-50 Blend. Look, I love that springy, really pretty green. That would be so beautiful in some roll eggs with like even just white or yellow or something. You're gonna see this in some roll eggs. Or with the, um, the March blend that was, I think Merino and Firestar. I would add that some of that into, and I still have most of it. I actually felted a shamrock out of that. I should probably show you guys that in an upcoming video. Keep your eyes open. Oh, and some honey sticks. We get these um, at the farmer's market here. But I'm seriously thinking about keeping some bees. I wonder if anyone has opinions about that. Oh, this says, oh God, how fun. 
A special treat bloomin'. Each confetti heart is embedded with a mix of seeds. Soak confetti in water overnight, tear up and plant under a thin layer of soil, blah, blah, soil water daily until seeds germinate, one to three weeks. Seeds may be five spot, catch fly, English daisy, baby blue eyes, Siberian wallflower, scarlet flax, zinnia, sweet william pinks, gloriosa daisy, candy tuff, spurred snapdragon, corn poppy, and black eyed susan. Oh my gosh, that is awesome. That might be the coolest thing I've seen. Because all this confetti can go in my garden now. Like I'm not just gonna dump it, I'm not gonna just save it, which I never do. But for like some other down the road project, this is cool. This is the coolest. So I'll actually put these in one little spot in my garden and I'll show you guys. Um, so that is May. I'm gonna be doing some filming on one of my spinning projects right now this week, and hopefully I'll get it up this weekend. I'm sorry, you guys, it's just been crazy, and I know I keep saying, like, I'm gonna do better, and I am actually doing a little bit better, but you don't see the results yet. I'm working on it. So I will see you later this weekend. Thank you so much for watching, and thank you so much, Bobby, at Paradise. I just, you... <sighs> I totally love these boxes. They're so fun. I was just telling someone if I was going to let a subscription box go, this is the last one that I would let go.